Hello, hello, hello. Good morning, good morning. This is Darkest Dungeon. Ooh. Ruin has come to our family. You remember our venerable house? Opulent and imperial, gazing proudly from its stoic perch above the moor. I lived all my years in that ancient, rumor-shadowed manor, fattened by decadence and luxury. And yet I began to tire of conventional extravagance. Singular unsettling tales suggested the mansion itself was a gateway to some fabulous and unnameable power. With relic and ritual, I bent every effort towards the excavation and recovery of those long-buried secrets, exhausting what remained of our family fortune on swarthy workmen and sturdy shovels. At last, in the salt-soaked crags beneath the lowest foundations, we unearthed that damnable portal of antediluvian evil. Our every step unsettled the ancient earth. But we were in a realm of death and madness. In the end, I alone fled laughing and wailing through those blackened arcades of antiquity. Until consciousness failed me. You remember our venerable house. Opulent and imperial. It is a festering abomination. I beg you, return home, claim your birthright, and deliver our family from the ravenous clutching shadows of the darkest dungeon. Yeah, okay. I, I love it when they have these things without subtitles, so you're going to have to deal with that yourself if you didn't hear it properly. Okay, Darkest Dungeon is about making the most of a bad situation. Quests will fail or must be abandoned. Heroes will die, and when they die, they stay dead. Progress auto saves frequently, so actions are permanent. The game expects a lot of you. How far would you push your... Just fucking read it now. Darkest Dungeon. Press any button to start. Fucking quit. Um... Campaign. Select a, a letter to begin. Stygian? I don't know what that means. Stygian campaigns are not for the faint of heart. Expect no quarter, no forgiveness. You must conquer the evil within a time and hero death limit. Also, many gameplay settings are, are locked. Yeah, well, we don't want that then. Radiant campaigns are still challenging, are adjusted to be faster and more forgiving than normal. Suggested for your first Darkest Dungeon experience. Yeah, we'll go with that then. Enter estate name. Yep, that'll do. Begin. You have no idea how fucking loud this is in my ears. I can't wait to turn it down. You will arrive along the old road. It winds with a troubling, serpent-like suggestion through the corrupted countryside. Leading only, I fear, to ever more tenebrous places. There is a sickness in the ancient, pitted cobbles of the old road. And on its writhing path, you will face viciousness, violence, and perhaps other damnably transcendent terrors. So steal yourself, and remember there can be no bravery without madness. The old road will take you to hell, but in that gaping abyss, we will find our redemption. Yay! Can we get on with it, please? 
with the stagecoach destroyed and the caretaker gone, you will have to make the journey to the hamlet on foot. Press any button to continue. Oh, what the fuck is this? Map navigation. You are currently in a room. To move towards another room, use right stick to select a destination room on the map. This will take you to your connecting hallway. Press B button to close this window. Okay. Use right stick. Use right stick to select a destination room on the map. Brigands have run up these lanes. Keep to the side path. The hamlet is just ahead. While in a hallway, use left stick to move forward or backwards. Press B to close this window. Fucking hell. Right. Subtitled on could have been good if that had been uh, available from the beginning. So let's switch my camera over to there because I don't know what it's covering for the people watching this. Not that anyone does. Save these changes. Save A. Let's go back. Turn the game. Okay. After all of that, this is what I get, is it? Dispatch this thug in brutal fashion, that all may hear of your arrival. Combat half. Fuck off. Combat is turn-based. On your hero's turn, select a skill icon and then select a target. If you can't select a particular skill, it's because that hero needs to be standing in a different spot and there are no valid targets. Highlight the skill to see the requirements. Right. Grape shot blast. Yeah, let's just choose that. Choose the target. Stunning blow. Smite. Something un unholy. Go. Choose the target. Yes. Their formation is broken. Maintain the offensive. Each item, if you take it, will occup occupy space in the inventory. Uh, LT, blah, blah. Press B button to close this window. Victory. You have found 250 coins. Excellent. Fantastic. Okay. Press A to investigate. Investigate A. Treasure. Leave nothing unchecked. There is much to be found in forgotten places. Right, okay. What am I doing? Ah. An ambush. Send these vermin a message. The rightful owner has returned, and their kind is no longer okay. welcome. Okay. Lead deeper. Dodge, dodge. Point blank shot. Crit. Resist.
prodigious size alone does not dissuade the sharpened okay. blade. Why have you just attacked the fucking large corpse? Why can't I choose that on there? Why can't I? I don't understand why I can't choose a different weapon, a different attack. I can't seem to attack anything apart from the corpse. Let's attack the corpse, shall we? Ah, it's gone! Okay, so that now means this guy. So that now I can attack him. As the fiend falls, a faint hope blossoms. Okay. My quest is complete. Yeah, my quest is up as well, because this is fucking shit. I'm not interested in this at all. Goodbye.